come close to me and I'll make you regret it. Okay. Oh shoot! She's she's serious! Um, she's serious! We we got ourselves a boss fight! Okay, guys, guys, I can explain. I calm down. I didn't exactly make a video on it, but I did go on another trip, which you could probably assume from uh, the last video, Water Lad. Water Lad was a good Water Lad. As you can see, I'm a, I look a bit different. Uh, you know, hair hair's still kind of normal. It's a little messy today. Uh, I, as you can see, I got a little bit of a, a mustache going on. Uh, what do you guys think of that, by the way, real quick? What do you think of that? Should I keep it? I've had some people say that I should keep it. I'm personally not that big of a fan of it, but whatever, uh, please tell me your thoughts. But anyway, hi, I'm back, and it's time for some Celeste. So, hello everyone, I am Inky Ink, and today, we are back with another episode of Celeste. It has been a long time since I made a video on this, and I really, I really need to finish this game. So, I'm just gonna skip past all the, all the talking stuff I realized by doing this, I'm, okay, I'm just, we're going right in, no wasting time. Over 1,500 deaths. Let's go straight into Reflection, Chapter 6. It is impossible to outrun your own reflection. Thanks, postcard. I really appreciate that. Alright, here we are. Oh, that's right, in the last episode, Theo got yeeted. Uh, we were inside our own mind and stuff. That was kind of weird. Ooh, this is a nice looking little area. Alright, looks like we're gonna get some dialogue right away. <laughs> Theo, you're awake. Am I? I'm skeptical. I had a messed up nightmare. Yeah, about that. Wait. Oh, yep, it's all coming back to me now. That actually happened. Thanks for getting us out of there. I'm glad we were in it together. I don't know if I could have done that alone. We get to choose dialogue options? What? Since when are we controlling Theo? How long was I out for? How long was I out for? It must have been a few hours. Man, what a ride. Tell me about it. Are you okay? I mean, aside from the existential crisis, yeah, I'm fine. So what's really going on here? Clearly this isn't a normal mountain. What's really going on here? I should have told you sooner. Back at the old ruins, a uh, part of me escaped from a mirror. A part I'm not very proud of. I swear I dreamt it. Nah, that, that actually happened. You think the mountain made her real? Yeah. She's been haunting me the whole time. She lashed out at Mr. Oshiro. I think she was the reason the gondola stalled out. And she was there in the temple. Yeah, he's... Why didn't you say something? I wouldn't have gone into that temple if I knew this mountain was capable of. I tried to stop you. You could have mentioned that your demon doppelganger was on the loose. Come on, Theo. You know how crazy that sounds. I didn't even believe myself. Okay, okay. I understand. Next time, just talk to me, though. I promise I'll believe you. Okay. Alright! What? How, why all of a sudden are we getting dialogue options? This is interesting all right uh thank you for believing in me back there thank you theo for believing me in me back there i mean believing in you was the easy part i wish i could have helped i was pretty useless stuck in that thing you actually helped a lot yeah we we punched todd todd was a was a very bad man i don't like him honestly i couldn't have made it without your support why is it so easy for you to trust me? Seriously, you barely know me. Honestly? You remind me of my sister. That's adorable. What is she like? Oh, you'd love her. Actually, you might not get along at first, but you'd eventually love her. She's a literal rock star. Wait, like, literally? <laughs> she's a musician? That's so cool. Okay, she's not literally a literal rock star. Alex is just amazing at everything. She's studying to be a civil rights lawyer. Well, that's nice. Wow! How do I remind you of her? You both live so deep inside your own heads. Oh. 
Alex has this amazing internal compass. It's obvious that she'll get where she needs to be. I can see that in you, too. I wish I could say the same for myself. What? Now we're choosing between two people! What it? What is happening? Uh... Let's do this because it's on topic. Your sister sounds great. I really remind you of her? Are you kidding me? You're the one who's dead set on climbing this mountain. And you don't even know why. That's classic Alex. Hmm, interesting. I'm just using you. Why are you climbing the mountain anyways? You're right, I don't even know why. I just had to get out of my head. I'm stuck in a cycle. You're preaching to the choir here. I've had many a soul-destroying day job. Work is fine, actually. I just... I'm going crazy. I can't stop thinking about dumb crap that doesn't matter. My brain fixates on, the stupid, on these stupid things that happened forever ago. I should be over them. None of it even matters. Oh boy. What happened to Madeline? This is... This is getting intriguing. This is deep. I'm good at keeping up appearances, but the truth is I'm barely holding it together. I'm sorry, that's pretty rough stuff. Can I help? You're already helping. It feels good to say it out loud. You don't talk to anyone about it? Nope, not really. My mom knows I get depressed and I have panic attacks. That's about it. No wonder you feel trapped. How do you cope with anything? I drink mostly. Oh, shoot! She's an alcoholic. And get mad at people on the internet. We have so many options! What is happening? I'm gonna try and get through this as fast as I can, but is this whole- is this whole chapter just talking? How about you? What brought you to the mountain? I'm just kind of bumming around, as usual. I started this new job in Seattle. I thought I finally knew what I was supposed to be doing with my life, but I hated it. So I quit after a week and hopped a bus to Canada. I just felt this urge to get lost in the middle of nowhere. Now that I'm saying out loud, I realize how flaky it sounds. It just sounds like you're under a lot of pressure. Not really. Everyone is so patient with me. Though I guess I am putting on a lot of pressure on myself. People always think I'm comparing myself to Alex, but I swear that isn't the problem. I'm just worried that I'll never figure out where I'm going. Deep. This is a deep conversation, guys. You said you wanted to feel lost. Maybe you should just embrace that for now. Maybe. Who do you think built the temple? It looks ancient. It must predate everything else on the mountain. The resort, the ruins, the city. There's a lot of history there. Yeah. This mountain has meant so many things to so many people. I'm starting to understand why that crazy old lady lives here. You ran into her too? What's her deal? I think she's just a mean person. She's not that mean, but she does seem pretty content living out here. Alright. Y'all ready to hit her with the big question? Let's do this. Would you mind talking about what depression is like? I don't think she was. It sucks. Yeah, but what does it feel like? Alex struggles with it too. I really want to understand. We can talk about something else if you want. It's like... I'm at the bottom of the ocean. I can't see anything in any direction. It's claustrophobic, yet I feel exposed. Dang. I remember feeling normal, but now it just feels out of reach no matter what I try. Then again, I was probably always messed up. It just took something hurtful to bring it out. There must be something wrong with me. That is incorrect! It's not your fault, whatever it is. Whatever happened, I'm sure it's not your fault. See? I'm just in sync with these characters right now. It's I've said their dialogues multiple times without trying to. It's crazy. I guess I thought that I could... I don't know. I'm just floating in this abyss, swimming in a random direction, hoping that I find something. That's really why I'm here. But I can't escape myself. I'm literally fighting myself the entire way. Maybe this is all pointless. Madeline, you just saved my life. That's not pointless. Yeah. Look, you're a good person. You're a little intense, but you're a good person. I think you're just trying to push out of that rut you're stuck in. And that's a totally legit reason to climb the mountain. Maybe. That's helpful. 
This part of you that's haunting you. Maybe she comes with the with the territory. So you think I'm stuck with her forever? Well, she's stuck with you too. That's not helpful. Oh, there's so more, so much more. Uh, but guys, I think to get the best ending, I gotta talk. I gotta talk all this. I'm sorry if this is boring. I'm gonna try and keep it interesting. I hope you're enjoying yourselves. Uh, so you want to destroy this part of you? Won't that hurt you too? If I don't, she's just going to keep bullying me. She says she's protecting me, but that's obviously not true. Maybe she thinks she is. She could be some kind of twisted defense mechanism. Honestly, who cares? She has so much control over me. I hate it. Maybe you can learn to control her instead. The feather helps a lot. Thanks for teaching me that. Just one of my grandpa's many nuggets of wisdom. Are you close to your grandpa? Yeah, I was. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. That's just how it is. All I can do is stay positive and live a meaningful life. Because that's what he would want. I'm so sorry, Theo. Thanks. There's so many options! <laughs> what else did you learn from your grandpa? So much stuff. Actually, he was the one who told me about Celeste Mountain. He always said that this place changed his life. After I quit my job in Seattle, I realized how close I was to it. I felt like he was telling me to come here. Your grandpa said the mountain was special. Do you think he went through the temple like us? Do you think he understood the power of the mountain? He never talked about what happened here. I doubt your grandpa was really was as messed up as me. His experience was probably less violent. He found the mountain before I was born. I don't know what he was like before that. I wonder what he learned about himself there. Alright. Why not take a vacation instead? What do you mean? Dude, you needed a change, so you chose to climb a mountain. Why not do something relaxing instead? Go to Hawaii, or like, take a bath. I guess I feel like I need to accomplish something. Sounds like you have enough on your plate already. I guess this- I guess it was kind of extreme. But that's how I am. I need something to challenge me. I can't just do something a little bit. It's all of me or nothing. Uh, I think we're narrowing it down, guys. I think we're coming to a close. You know what? I want to remember this night. Let's take a selfie. I thought you'd never ask. Let's go! Squad! Oh, that's so amazing! That's great. You know, despite everything, I feel pretty good right now. Wait a second. You're going to reach the summit tomorrow. Don't jinx it. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm ready to put this all behind me. I'll be cheering you on. We should get some sleep. Okay, good night, Theo. Thanks for being cool. What can I say? It comes naturally. Oh, we in the dreamland now. Oh, we in the dreamland now, and we can play. Alright, let me get used to the controls again. Alright, so we got the feather. Green fire, looking cool, kind of like, you know, nether update, but a little, little different. Okay, guys, before we get started, let's just talk about that conversation. This is a great game. I'm just gonna say it. This is, this is a really deep story, and I can really appreciate that. This is really good. So let's touch this feather. What the heck? <gasps> I can fly! Oh! Oh, we in it now. Oh, we're in it now, boys. Boys and girls. I can fly. I can fly. Where the heck are we? This is crazy. Look at this place. Just when you think it can't get any crazier, we can fly. And we're going up. We be going up. We be going up to the skies. This place is beautiful. Oh, music's intensifying. Where? Whoa. The northern lights are so beautiful. Yeah, they are. Where are we? We're having a confrontation, guys! This is epic! We need to talk. Okay. I finally understand who you are. You're not my true reflection. I'm not? You're everything I need to leave behind. 
You're cruel, paranoid, controlling. Why would you say that? No, it's okay. I understand now. I don't need you anymore. So you're just abandoning me? I'm setting you free. We'll both be so much happier. You're so, so, so stupid. Oh shoot, she's coming out of the box. You think you can just leave me behind? You think you can blame everything on me? You think you're above me? She's really crawling out, answer me. Calm down, please. Calm down? Breathe, Madeline. Use the feather. Use the feather! Oh yeah, feather time. Let's go. Let's go, feather time. Let's go! I love this part. You have no power here, mirror. Oh, I'm, I need to- oh, I need to get my- I'm not good at this. This is a harder one. This is a harder one, guys. We go up. No, 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 it's shaking, it's shaking, it's- No! You're going to think about a feather to stop me? Oh, no! You are not above me. And you can't climb this mountain. Oh, no. It's time to accept that. No! I failed! Oh, no! Madeline, what's happening? No! Oh, no! No! Was that supposed to happen? Or did I just mess up? Oh, no. No. Oh, no. We're falling. Oh, we're gonna... Oh, oh, oh! This stuff would normally kill us. My gosh. Oh, my gosh. We failed! Dang it! That was crazy. What is this? Oh, anger, anger man. Friends. Nope, nope. And now we go. No, 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 no. All right, to victory! This so far, this episode has been a lot to take in. Oh, yes, feather. Flight. Let's go. This is a cra this is the craziest episode yet, guys. Um, okay, so we gotta hit him. Nope, that was a bad idea. So I assume our goal for this episode is to get back up to the top where Theo is by flying. Because we can do that. Uh, what's in here? Oh! I was so close. It's over now. Why won't you leave me alone? I hate her. But she's part of me. I'll never be able to get rid of her. And she was right. I couldn't climb the mountain. We can make it! Don't give up! We, get, we got this! We got this, kiddo. And I, not kiddo, because you're... Obviously old enough to, to drink or something, whatever. Thank you! Thank you so much, sir! I shall now... Oh, we found the... the thing. We found the rhythm part, okay. Ooh. This is gonna be a rough one. There's the B-side, we gotta get that. Come on. Let's go. There we go. Woo! Oh, that was that was a tough one, guys. That was a tough one. That was a tough one. I will I will give it that. That was hard. But hey, we did it. And it only took me like 8 minutes or so. I think we're making some progress. I hope, I assume. Ooh. Was a little doo -doo -doo -doo. What the heck? Circle boy, does he kill us? Oh, he's like a little bumper. Hey, that's kind of fun. All right, buddy. Pinball. Pinball me. Oh wait, wait, wait. What's this? Oh, we have to dodge him. We can fail if we want, but I, I don't want to fail today, guys. I don't want to fail. I don't think you guys want to see me fail too. Actually, I think you do want to see me fail. I think that's the reason you're watching this video. You want to see me rage. Well, joke's on you, buckaroos. I'm a boss. Now we fly to victory. Hey! That was kind of clutch, though. I kind of reacted with instincts. My my gamer instincts. 
That's right, those exist. Don't hit the things! Don't hit the things! We did it! Yes! Humphrey! Humphrey, it's been so long since I've last seen you. Uh, oh, hi! Oh, hello again. Of course you're here. Calling it quits, I see. No, I fell. It's over. That's probably for the best. The mountain doesn't pull any punches. Y yeah, I get it. I wasn't strong enough to climb your stupid mountain. You can laugh at me if you want. Don't give up! <laughs> I didn't mean actually laugh. Sometimes you gotta know when to throw in the towel. You'll get over it. You know what? I had a lot of time to think, climbing out of this cave. And I'm already over it. Come on. No, we can't give up. That part of me was right. I can't do this. I'll just go home to my sad life and be miserable forever. You clearly aren't over it. Shut up, I know. I don't want to give up. But no matter how hard I try, she sabotages me. She sabotages me every step of the way. A lot of kids come here to climb this mountain only to give up. It's a shame that you fell. I was starting to think you'd make it. What makes me so special? I've never met someone so angry at themselves. <laughs> Honestly, I thought you'd reach the summit just to spite yourself. Gee, thanks. This girl you're talking about, it sounds like she's holding you back. Talk to me. Figure out why she's so scared. You think she's scared? I guess I never thought of it that way. Stop wasting both our time and ask her. What have you got to lose? I don't know how to find her. She's part of you, right? If you look for her, she won't take long to find. So you know about the mountain's power? Of course I know. I live I tried to warn you. You need to work on your messaging. A glimpse at the truth is good for people, even if most can't accept what they see. There's no shame in running back into your car and driving away. Someday you'll be ready. Then you'll come back. No. I'm going to see this through. No more running. I thought so. Good luck! How can you stand living here? Isn't it hard to deal with this all the time? It's true, you never really get used to it. But it keeps me sharp. I like that about it. But the mountain is so... confrontational. Sure, it doesn't beat around the bush. Celeste Mountain is a place of healing, dear. The first step of healing is confronting the problem. It's never easy. Tell me about it. Woo! Alright. Once again, we, we, get, we keep getting hit with the deep conversations. Can we take... Can we take this elevator? Is that a thing? Can we do this? Old lady, can you... Okay, guess not. Oh. Oh, here we go! Here we go. The vines are back. Alright, here we go. Oh, oh, it's moving back. It's afraid of me. Haha. -ha. Confrontation. Oh, wait, maybe it's leading me. Okay, um. Anger lad. Teach me the ways. Oh, wait, yes, thank you. Oh, we be falling. It's running from us. You can't hide. It's over. So far, I have not seen a single strawberry in this level, which could mean one of two things. Either. There are no strawberries, which would be nice, or I'm so bad at finding them that we haven't just haven't found a single one, which is the definitely less optimal outcome. You led me all the way back down, huh? Well, you can't hide from me anymore, buckaroo. Oh, whoa! Look at that boy. He thick. Oh boy. Look at this dude. Oh wow. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm so confused, what's going on? Where are we going? Into the heart of the thorns! We've arrived. Are you ready? Are you ready, guys? Here we go. The confrontation. There she is, Mirror Maddie herself. Looking for me? I thought you were done with me. That was a mistake. I'm sorry. You think you've got it all figured out. You think you don't need me. I said I'm sorry. We need to move past this. You expect me to trust you? 
You aren't innocent here either. But I know you're scared. Look, we're at rock bottom. There's no point in fighting. I can keep digging. I could pull us down to the center of the earth. What would be the point? Let's climb out of here. Together. Ooh, you see the little anime? <laughs> okay. Come close to me and I'll make you regret it. Okay. Oh, shoot! She's she's serious! Um, she's serious! We, we got ourselves a boss fight! So what's the goal? We touch her. Okay, that's how we do things. Oh, she's got a laser! She's got a gun! Boing. This almost feels like the final boss or something. Oh, shoot! Oh, no! Oh, yes! We got this. No, 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 don't get fall, don't crush, don't fall, don't die. Boing, boing, jump! Oh! You can't escape yourself! It's over, Mirror. It's over, Mirror Maddie. She's down the floor again. She's shooting two. Two at a time. She's getting desperate! She's getting desperate, guys. We got this. All this is, guys, all this is is an elaborate game of tag. That's all it is, guys. That's really all it is. Let's go. Die! We got this, we got this, guys. A feather, we're about to fly! This really is a final battle. I think, maybe, possibly. Let's go. Feather time, boys! Bing! Oh, that's not it? That's not the end? Okay. Okay, you still want to go? I'm still here. She's running out of power. She's just using one sphere now. We can't let her get away. Oh, she's she's sniping. She's got her sniper out. Ah! Sniper's not enough. Oh, we're in it now. I did you a favor. What, what was that exactly? What was that? You aren't a mountain climber. Yes, we are. I'm just trying to help you. Sniper, no sniping! None of this would have happened if you had listened to me! Incorrect! I die! Alright, anime jump, complete! Anime wall slide, complete! Anime power punch, complete! Anime super jump, complete! Anime falling, complete! Anime bouncing, complete! Anime jabbing, here we go! We're making it, guys! We're making it. Grab the feather. Grab the feathers. We're zooming. There we go. Boing! Oh. Music stopped. Music stopped. She backing up. We end this. Fine. You win. I guess you don't need me after all. If you want me to go away, I'll try. That's not what I want. I need your help now more than ever. Please, let's work together. Work together? You're joking, right? It's okay to be scared. This is interesting! They're hugging! She's- <gasps> she disappearing back into us? <gasps> oh? I think we just hit the avatar state, guys. Now our hair is floating anime style too! <gasps> it's just like in that cursed Pico game! Pico 8. We have the double jump! We have the double jump, guys! Yes! Guys, we did it. We beat Mirror Madeline. Well, did we beat her? I don't. We didn't beat her. We did it. We. We, we came to terms with ourselves and achieved insane levels of power. What is that? <gasps> it's her, she boosted us. So she's not just inside of us now. How did we do that? 
If we can climb like that, maybe we can still reach the summit. You still want to climb the mountain? Why would we go back up there? <gasps> Old lady! It's good to see you two playing nice. Hey, thanks for talking some sense into me earlier. Don't mention it. I'm glad I can still be useful every now and then. Madeline! Who's that? Is it Theo? It is! Of course it is! Madeline, you're okay. I ran down to help, but it looks like you're doing fine. Thanks, Theo. Honestly, maybe that fall was what I needed. Is this the part of you you were talking about? She's like an adorable goth Madeline. Hi. You were right, Theo. I shouldn't be afraid of her. If her and I work together, I think we can still finish the climb. That's so rad. Wait, no. I didn't agree to this. You said we'd talk about things first. You're right. I understand that you're scared. But we both know that this is something we want to do. We have to try one last time. Yeah, you've got this. I don't know. We were so close and then we, uh, fell. The mountain tore us apart. Yeah, that happened. But I have to believe we can put that behind us. I have to believe we're capable of this. It's not a bad idea. It, it'll still be difficult, mind you. But I'm amazed you got this far as, as far as you did, butting heads like you were. I reckon you can make it if you cooperate. Okay, I'll try. Can I help? You've already done so much for me. Let me hold your bag, at least. Good idea. This won't take long. Here we go! Woo! That's the end! That's the end of chapter six, guys! <gasps> Humphrey! I see Humphrey! Oh, that's cool! Look at that! This was a good chapter, guys! This was a this was probably my favorite chapter now. It definitely just slightly beat out two. Even though two had better music, this had much better in the story development. Even Humphrey's there. I'm that that's amazing. Alright, so there were no strawberries, right? There were no strawberries! Ladies and gentlemen, there were no strawberries. I see that as an absolute win. And guys, in the next episode, we will be climbing the summit. I might gather some strawberries off screen, and uh, yeah, we'll do that. But guys, we're almost at the end of this game. I'm probably going to do some episodes on B-sides and those crystal hearts or whatever, if, if you guys want me to. But as for the main story, I think this is the end. So, if you did enjoy this episode of Celeste, please be sure to splash the link onto the like button, consider subscription, maybe share this video with a friend. I apologize for the wait, uh, but I'm back in full swing now. Uh, tell me what you think of the, the mustache. If it, Yeah, that's a little awkward. Uh, but yeah, notify yourself if you want to know when the next episode comes out. Join the Discord, we have fun there, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Bye!